describe your background for us. Okay, so I'm Sam DeChupa. Background uh, education, I finished um, a Bachelor of Science degree in Information Technology in Manila. And then um, I worked for three years in Hewlett Packard in the Philippines. I supported SAP systems for Procter & Gamble, so different mo modules like inventory, master data management, purchasing. So I'm really interested now in project management, like working in teams, managing different phases of projects. So that's practically what I'm doing now in my internship with T-Mobile. I'm being exposed to the different phases of project management. Okay. Um, so work, when working on the Google Text project, what did you think about the idea of working on it, a textbook as a class project? Well, at first I found it really cool, like being like a co-author of a textbook that's actually going to be used by students and it's going to help them out on, you know, learning change management. But it was also very overwhelming because we were still learning about change management and at the same time we were actually writing a chapter about change management. So that's how I felt about the whole project. Okay, so how, then how did you feel about collaborating with actual people, like real world people like from varying points on the textbook project? Well, it, it felt really good, I guess, because we didn't really know anything about the chapter we were doing and we had a really hard time um, gathering data since we had this difficult chapter on assessing change management and there wasn't really a lot of information on that. So working and collaborating with the consultants from Bearing Point actually helped us in that. So they gave us a lot of um, pointers, a lot of data, and they gave us uh, you know, a benchmark on what, what actually we have to put in the chapter and how the flow should be and how it should all mesh together. So it was very, it, it was a good experience. So we learned a lot and we also learned how to work in a team, like work with consultants. So we learned basically everything about project management, change management, all at the same time. So then can you talk a bit about the process um, that you, the team went through to get the content for the chapter? Well, first of all, we got the outline from Kevin and um, we skimmed through the outline and we tried researching online, gathering data, and it was, and then we talked to the Bearing Point consultants and fortunately they have a lot of data on that chapter and they were able to help us out. So we met with them regularly and we, went, we met as a team as well, like trying to figure out the flow, trying to look for data together, researching together and I think it's more of like open communication, um, just meeting regularly and just sharing thoughts and opinions with each other. So it's more of team, teamwork, team management. So what were some of the challenges you faced and how did you overcome them? Well, like I've been saying about the, we had a really hard time looking for information on assessing change management. So we actually, asked help from Kevin so he was he was kind enough to help us with that so he gave us like textbooks and a lot of information on assessing change management and we also asked for help from the bearing point consultants and they were they were also willing to help so they sent us a few um, I think they were able to help us on like resources as well so and then Kevin also helped us on the flow and how to mesh things together so I think and we I guess we also had to figure it out ourselves we just went through the whole outline over and over again and tried to like get it all together and make the f make it all work together all the data that we got okay so what lessons did you learn from the project lessons well from the project, I think it's how to work well with people. Like, as a group, I guess, since we've been working for like almost two years, we really work well together. Like, we know each other, we listen to each other's opinions, to each other's ideas. But it's also like working with other, with new people, with other people. Like, we work with the Bearing Point consultants. So, we learned how to work cross functionally and we work with new people. And we also, you uh, learned how to be more resourceful like 
um, since we had the trouble with our research, with looking for resources, you know, we have to get out there and be more resourceful, ask for help, ask for, like we asked Kevin, we asked the Bearing Point consultants, and from that, we were able to get a lot of resources and we were able to finish the chapter. So I guess it's more of teamwork, you know, communication and resourcefulness. Okay, so what was the most enjoyable part of the project? Enjoyable part? Um, well, I guess the most enjoyable part was just learning along the way, the whole project, like learning about change management, and learning about, you know, gathering data, being resourceful, and working together. It just, and actually having a final product was very enjoyable. Like, we got everything together. We really had a hard time, like, putting things together. But in the end, it, it just felt so good that we got the final product. We were able to put things together. It, it made sense. And the Bearing Point consultants liked it. And um, Kevin, I think, also liked it because we got a good grade. So that was, I think, that was the most enjoyable part. And you know, working together, working as a team, it's always fun. So, so do you have any advice for like, other students who might be a part of another global textbook project? Like, what advice do you have for them? Well, or possibly even just this project too. Well, I believe time management is really important. Like, make sure you have enough slack time in case you miss something or you need to make changes, you know, revisions. And be very resourceful. Don't, don't be ashamed to ask for help. Like, ask for help from the consultants, from Kevin. They have a lot of information that can help you. And make sure you understand the outline, like um, the flow. Like, make sure there's a flow and there's actually, and you actually put everything together. Just don't keep putting stuff down and it just doesn't go together. So I think that's it. Like time management, teamwork, and communication is very important. Okay. Um, any other comments or things you want to say about the global textbook project? Mm, well, I think it's a very, very, I, I find it amazing. Like people are actually working on the global textbook project for, for um, developing countries, like I believe it's going to be sent to Africa, or I think uh, I'm not really sure wh which countries who ha don't have enough money to buy books and being a part of that, you know, being to help out people on learning change management. It's it, I just feel like it's it's amazing. It's overwhelming. Okay. That's it. Okay. Thanks.